drugstore and call for Paula. Or no, Ness's sister for uh, getting stuff taken care of, taken away from our inventory. Say <clears throat> Oh, is that you, Ness? Big bro, it's me, Tracy. I'm working part time for Escargo Express. What can I do for you? Pick up. You want us to store something for you? Well, I, we'll send someone over immediately to pick it up. Click. Oh, <laughs> hey, Dad. Hello, it's your dad. You've been out there for a long time now. It may be none of my business, but don't you think it would be a good idea if you took a break? No. Ah, I see. Well, it doesn't make me happy, but I understand your point about the fate of the world being at stake. Click. Beep. So, I see a lot of you folks here. I'm going to say hello to all of you. Let's see. <laughs> Atani, Capchico, Cramage, Mick, Mushroom, Mehead, Militia, Mojo, Mikey321, Motivated Zombie, Owen, Nap, Sheep, Lovey, the Sheep, Lover, the Jimmy Costner. How are you guys? Mehead, Militia, my friend. How are you? I remember catching your stream the other night. It was amazing. I liked it. I had too much fun. So, you, sir, were not boring. I'm playing Earthbound. Awesome. Nice, McMushroo. Hello, this is Escargo Express. Your delivery charge is $18. You can cover the bill, right? Yeah. What do you want me to take? I can take up to three things. Mm, we want to keep that jar of fly, honey. So... Oh, why am I not... Why am I not wearing the Great Charm? I don't know. Wait, do I still have the bicycle? No. Alright. We're gonna have them take... The protractor. The ruler. We're gonna need these random things... At, uh, towards, uh... Foreside. What is up, guys? Oh my goodness, I see, like... My, uh, I see the viewers thing, like, going crazy. Like, people are showing up. So what's up? Oh, uh, let's get rid of the pack of bubblegum, too. Let me confirm your request. The protect, the protractor, the ruler, and the pack of bubblegum? Is this correct? Yes. All right, certainly. Thanks a lot. 18 bucks to take a pack of gum and store it for me. Really? That's, that's... I'm sorry, that's a lot of money. Alright, we have Jeff. Where do we want to go? User joined your channel. Oh yeah, I need to put myself in the team speak. Uh whoa, okay. Channel switched. So yeah, guys, we are doing a dual stream tonight. I am excited. Because I, I do need to mix it up a little bit. We need to get some... We need to get, like, two games a day. Now what? <clears throat> Hello? <clears throat> Hello? This is Apple Kid. I just want to let you know that I've had a pretty unique invention. I'm not sure if it will help you or not. It's called zombie paper. And it can be used to trap zombies. It works kind of like flypaper. All you need to do is place the paper on the floor of a tent or something. You've seen at least one tent around, right? And then the zombies get stuck to the paper. When they move around inside the tent, you can catch a lot of zombies this way. In fact, I bet you could get rid of all the zombies that are terrorizing the area with this paper. Anyway, I just want to make the mock pizza delivery man. I just asked the mock pizza delivery man to deliver the zombie paper to you, Ness. You should be ready. You should get it pretty soon. I've never actually seen a zombie, but if there really are any, zombie paper would be very useful. I'll be calling you if I come up with anything else. And he hangs up on me. <laughs> <clears throat> While delivering pizza, this weird guy asked me to help him out. 
He wanted me to deliver this to someone named Ness, who's wandering around three. No one else knows about this, right? Let's just pretend that you're Ness, and I'll give this to you. Oh, hello, Ness! Just go along with me on this one, okay? I made this decision that you're Ness, no matter what. Paula got the zombie paper. That's right, Ness! Wink, wink. I've done my duty and given you Apple Kid's thingamajig. Well, goodbye! Go figure, what are the chances, guys? The mock, deliver mock pizza delivery guy literally picks someone out in town. It's us. And it's like, oh, we're just going to give you this inventor's thingamajig. And um, you know what? There's this tent here, so let's go use it. These people are freaking out in here. They're running in here and just like, oh, my God, zombies! So, let's see. We should try zombie paper or some kind of trap. We have to do something. Really? So you're going to use this tent as a trap? Hmm. Well, we'll give it a try. It's better than nothing, I guess. What's this guy say? Maybe a good idea would be to try to get all the zombies into a single spot. Oh my gosh, really? This guy at the pizza joint told me about a new product called zombie paper. Dude, you were in the tent the whole time. You can do whatever you want. Just save my life. Oh, dude, you suck. I believe you ran from your family. Paula placed the zombie paper on the floor. All right. Let's go. Uh, my deed is done. Let's go. Let's go have a night in the hotel. We need to see if Jeff can fix stuff. Oh, the snake. I've never actually seen a snake here. I think the emulator broke. Yeah, we got one experience. I'm wondering if the emulation is breaking because it's it could potentially be too much. Oh yeah. And if you remember, here's what it should sound like. When we got our faces wrecked by that woman who was working with the zombies and ghosts with it was just me and uh, when it was Ness and Paula. Uh, before we got Jeff, you can tell the music was all weird. Now it's not. <clears throat> Welcome to the Three Sunset Hotel. A one night stay will cost you $180. Would you like to stay? Sure, I've got the money as a kid. Have a nice stay. It's like, sure, Ryan, why not? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Guys, the zombies, they're invading. Oh, no. Honey, protect yourself. Board up the windows, the doors. Keep us safe from all the zombies. Oh, no. You are retarded. <laughs> hey, I don't use that language here. I know I'm ridiculous. So's my mug. Sir, you're working hard, even through your young, even though you're young. The guests' newspaper that were delivered to the hotel today are different than normal. The paper is called the Zombie Herald. I'm scared, but let me tell you what's in it. Boogie Tent Falls. Young human to blame. Hmm. Young human to blame. A few days ago, the zombies got some kids at this hotel. The boy had a red cap. Hey, it was you! Uh, yeah, obviously. You know, we may have uh, gotten hurt. Good morning! Did you sleep well? I sure did. Let's go see how our uh, zombie paper did, guys. Oh, so the music's all crazy still. Uh, my bad. Yuck! We caught a lot of zombies! Ugh! <sighs> It's really gross. You might not understand my saying this, but poor zombies. Really? <clears throat> I was able to arrest many zombies because of your help. <laughs> arrest? Sounds strange, doesn't it? We did it. Did you look in the tent? Yaha! We taught those stupid zombies a lesson. I don't know what my wife fed me, but it tastes like peanut butter. Look at all these zombies. Uh, if I try to get away, 
my body would just fall apart. Do you like it? It's because I'm a zombie. Like it? Those zombies stuck to the floor. I wonder if they could still get me. I don't care what happens to anyone else. I just want to save my own skin. Zombie paper really works, so I hope someone comes up with pretty curl paper. Oops, that was a ni that wasn't a nice thing to say. Okay, stop being a gym rat. Stop being a gym rat. Meathead, was that you? Was that you in there? You want pretty girl paper? Okay, now that they're gone, I think those dudes at the cave or whatever that entrance was are going to be gone, so I want to try and get into this graveyard without having to fight a bunch of zombies. Oh, that's right. I got to equip the charm. Charms go on the body, guys. User joined your All right, let's see. Anyone else have charms? Yeah, I'm here. What's up? All right, I realize before we leave, we need to get Jeff um, some protection. Let's go beat these guys. I believe these are... What's up? What is this Earthbound game? I've never seen it. This is for the Super Nintendo. It's, it's an old gem. It is a gem, guys. What do you think, Meathead? I'm curious. Like you're one of the older folks that I know of here in the community. Um, if you're if you're still watching, uh, what do you think of Earthbound? Like, what's your take on uh, some of these retro games? Deranged version of Pokemon. Oh, that teddy bear! This is not an old version of Pokemon. This was before Pokemon, and it's amazing. Smash! Yeah! What do you guys think about these retro games? Ness's level is now 20. Oh, baby! Offense went up by 3. Defense up by 1. Guts up by 2. Luck up by 1. Max HP up by 1. Ness realized the power of life up beta. Jeff's level is now 11. Defense up by 1. Speed up by 1. Max HP up by 3. Sweet. Yep. Yeah. User left your channel. Huh? It just does. What? What do you mean when we get it? Because it's fresh. Oh. Heck yeah, Ness is evolving, Kappa. Oh, motivated zombie, way to go, man! All right, which of you is gonna carry this, Jeff? Yes, he's going to equip it. Look at that defense. 18 to 23. Would you like me to buy your home's hat? Yes. Can I get you anything else? Yeah. We need a copper bracelet for that uh, genius over there. Equip it. Yeah. 23 to 33. Nice. His defense is growing. All right. Don't get me anything else. So... Because we have the money, we're going to go talk to this little black market dude right here. Right before we leave. He's got some items that I think are going to be useful to Jeff. Shh! Don't talk too loud. What do you want to buy? Who's going to lug this around? Jeff. Okay. I suppose you're going to want to equip it here. Yes. Jeff's offense changed from 27 to 43. Oh my god. The pop gun? I'd say about 55. Take it or leave it. Hell yeah, give me 55 bucks for my pop gun. Excellent. Glad we could work something out. 
So, will there be anything else? No. Will that 